Hey everyone, welcome to creating a WordPress theme from scratch. In this video, we will first be downloading Local by Flywheel, which will allow us to set up a local WordPress site. It is free and it takes only a minute. Let's go ahead and do that. You can also use your preferred WordPress hosting tool. Once it's installed, we can add it to our applications and then open. And once it is open, we can go ahead and create a new site. Create new site, continue. We'll name it my first theme, continue. We can use this preferred environment continue give it a username and password add site next we want to click on site folder which is going to open up where our site folder is you can also go through here to get to it so this shows us exactly where our site is installed here we have my first theme which is what we named our site. We want to go ahead and go to app, public, WP content, and then themes. Inside, you'll see these different themes that are pre-installed when we created our WordPress site. We're going to want to create a folder there. We'll name it my first theme. This is where our themes code is going to live. Inside of the my first theme folder, we want to create a style.css. In order to do that, we'll need to open this in a code editor. If you don't have a code editor installed, you can go ahead and download Visual Studio Code. If you have that installed and you press this, we should be able to automatically open up our code. So here we see that we are inside my first theme. And we can verify that by checking the WP content themes and we see my first theme we can see there's nothing in there we can right click on it new file style.css press enter if we minimize this and we look at the site folder we can verify it was created there and it is there in our style.css we're going to go ahead and write the following code And we'll go ahead and save that. And in my first theme, uh, we're going to create another file. We'll call this one index.php. This is going to be our home page template. And we'll use the get header function and get footer to load reusable sections. Save. Now we can minimize this. We want to go to WordPress admin now and activate the theme and view our site. We can log in using username and password. Once we're in, appearance, themes, my first theme, activate, visit site, and we see my first theme with hello WordPress as we added in that index.php file. Right now it's basic, but this is the foundation. In the next video, we'll add headers, footers, and dynamic content. Congrats! We created a WordPress site through Local by Flywheel and we built our first WordPress theme. Next time we'll make it dynamic. Subscribe and smash the like button if it helped and I'll catch you in the next video.